Hey grillers, welcome back to BB Grill Shack, where we focus on barbecue tips, tricks, recipes, and more. I'm your host, Brad, and today I'm gonna to be showing you another simple but delicious barbecue recipe. Today we're gonna to be making this amazing honey Dijon glazed barbecue chicken drumstick recipe, which can be cooked on most grills or in the oven. This drumstick recipe is quick and easy. It's very tasty, pairs well with almost anything, and the glaze really takes the drumsticks to the next level. So let's go ahead and get started. We're gonna start off with two pounds of chicken drumsticks. This is about six to eight drumsticks. Make sure to remove any pieces of bone, fat, or chicken skin that might affect your final product. Now let's prepare our spice rub for the drumsticks. I'm just making a simple home blend, which is one half of a tablespoon of black pepper, one half of a tablespoon of salt, one half of a tablespoon of garlic powder, one half of a tablespoon of paprika, and one quarter teaspoon cayenne pepper. Mix your spice rub together until it's nice and evenly mixed, and then we're gonna go ahead and apply it to our drumsticks. Sprinkle the rub on your chicken and be sure to hit all sides so nothing misses the flavor. I like to let the rub sit on the chicken for at least 10 minutes while I heat up the grill to 325 degrees Fahrenheit. Arrange your drumsticks on the grill and space them evenly. We're gonna let these cook for 25 minutes before we come back and flip them. If you're using a gas grill or a charcoal grill that has direct heat, these cooking times are gonna be shorter, so go ahead and plan accordingly. While our chicken is on the grill, we're gonna go ahead and mix up a really simple but really delicious honey Dijon mustard glaze. This honey Dijon mustard glaze is one quarter cup honey, one quarter cup brown sugar, two tablespoons of honey Dijon mustard, and one quarter teaspoon apple cider vinegar. After the first 25 minutes on the grill, the chicken is ready to be flipped. Since we have our grill open at this point, it's also a good time for us to start heating up our glaze. Place the glaze onto the grill in a spot that won't receive any direct heat to avoid burning the sugars in the glaze. Set another timer for 20 minutes. After the second set of 20 minutes, our chicken should be cooked and done, but go ahead and check it with a meat thermometer just to be sure. Before we take the drumsticks off the grill, let's go ahead and take our glaze and glaze all sides of each drumstick and put it back on the grill for five minutes. This is gonna help set the glaze so that the glaze gets really sticky and really stuck to the drumsticks themselves. Once our glaze is set, the drumsticks are done. It's time to take them off your grill and set them aside to rest for five or 10 minutes. Just as a heads up, the juices are gonna be trapped inside that crispy chicken skin and they will be very hot. So if you bite into them right now, you might burn your mouth or chin. I served my drumsticks with corn on the cob, guacamole, and homemade chips. This made for a really fantastic and really healthy meal. Thanks for sticking around, you guys. I really enjoyed making this video, I really enjoyed making this recipe, and I really enjoyed eating it. If you guys like this recipe, I'm gonna leave a link to my recipes playlist. Go ahead and check it out. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks, you guys. Have a good weekend, and I'll catch you next week.